Chapter 1. I am your coach. The simplicity of tennis sport session. development. Mm -hmm. Solo and travel what is diamonds. Your name? We've got Loiso. Yes. We've got Rossi. These are our champions. Guys, we're just gonna make tennis simple. Tennis. We're just gonna make it simple. Everything is simple. Ne? Yes. Everything that people used to say it's difficult. In actual fact, it's simple. It's up to you how you approach it. So this lesson for today is all about the basic of tennis. We've got we've got forehand, we've got backhand, we've got serve. So these are the three things that I want us to to concentrate on. Okay? But today's lesson is all about forehand, racket projection, and the faces of the racket. Before you hit the ball, your, your racket, you need to know how is your racket supposed to move before you touch the ball. Okay, so as you can see here, we've got six stations. Station number one, station number two, number three, number four, number five, and we're going to finish at station number six where we are adding the elbow then you will see as i demonstrate here uh, how are we gonna go about so uh, can you all see me okay station number one you're gonna stand like an athlete and like an athlete ready position here is your racket in the middle if you don't know the grip ne, just put your racket on the ground and you just pick it up as it is then that's your first grip you're not gonna keep on changing keep it as as it is okay so this is all these cones all these cones except except this one it's for they represent the the racket face okay so now how many rackets do we have two yeah okay racket number one Racket face number one, ready position, you split, then you turn, goalie position. Yeah, that, that's how you, you stand, goalie position. Now you're gonna do it five times. One, two, three, four, five. Then you are done with station number? One. So how many rackets did we do here? Two. two. Now we come to station number two, okay? Station number two, you repeat the same thing, but station number two, we have added racket number three. three. So you do the same thing. Okay, we are starting. One, two, three. One, one, two, three, two. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now you are done. Right foot, if you are right handed, ne? you're gonna step there. Okay, before you hit the ball okay I'm, I'm, I'm going to repeat it it's racket one two three step then you swing and stop you understand yes. okay one two three step swing and stop and make sure that when you when you stop uh, the racket should be in front of your front knee which is I'm a right-handed, it will be my left knee. You hit it there. You don't hit at the back of your knee. Why? Because of that contact, it will be a late contact. You need to hit it early in front of your knee. Okay, I'm gonna do it again. One, two, three, step and in front of my knee. This is where I'm stopping. Okay, so I'm progressing to number to number four. Okay, number four, you are going to repeat number one two three so at number four we are adding another racket now okay it's gonna be one two three four five but number five you are going to stop your racket up over your head okay let me demonstrate it okay it's one two three step hit the ball and you stop there can you see okay one, two, three, step, hit the ball, and you, uh, do you uh, are you getting it? We progress to station number? Six, five. Number five. 
So station number five, you still do the same thing. You repeat what you did at number one, two, three, four. Now you, we are ending. One more. I think it. All right, all right. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, let's say. Let's finish it. Okay, let's. This station is almost the same as that one. Ne? Yes. It's fine. So let's move to his station because this one was supposed to be this one. It's fine. So station number five. Station number five. We are adding something. Where you are going to swing the racket? Where you are going to finish? Okay. So now I have written on this code. I have written elbow. This is where your elbow is supposed to stop. Okay. Let me demonstrate. It's one, two, three, step, four, five, and six. 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 But can, can, can you see at six what, what's happening? Yes. For this elbow, this elbow is supposed to stop there. You understand? Yes. So how are we gonna do it? It means and can you see it's locking here? Yes. It's not supposed to lock. And six. 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 But can, can, can you see at six what, what's happening? Yes. For this elbow, this elbow is supposed to stop there. You understand? Yes. So how are we gonna do it? It means, and can you see it's locking here? Yes. It's not supposed to lock. So we need to fix it. Then this is where you're gonna do another step. You understand? Okay, let's try. One, two, three, four, five, and that's where you, you 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 stop you see every time after hitting your elbow should stop there okay i'm gonna repeat it slowly now it's one two three step number four then drag it up then you take elbow can you see the elbow yes sharp so after finishing all these stations you're gonna come here and do it without the guidance of the cones. Do you get me what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So we, we are going to test you and see if you can do all these six steps without the guidance of the cones. Okay, now here we are. Okay, one, two, three, step. There. Am I doing all six of them? Yeah. Come on, you, you tell me. If I'm not doing it correctly, just... You see, that is you. And do it without the guidance of the cones. Do you get me what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So we, we are going to test you and see if you can do all these six steps without the guidance of the cones. Okay, now here we are. Okay, one, two, three, step. There. Am I doing all six of them? Yeah. Come on, you, you tell me. If I'm not doing it correctly, just you see, that is you. That's how you you do your your whole uh, 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 your whole swing, forehand swing. Okay, now I'm I'm doing it a little bit quick now. That's how professionals are doing at the end of the day. Look at the ball. Make sure that this hand you balance. Okay, split. Speed, turn, racket back, and hit. Speed, turn, racket back, stop, hit, and finish. You understand? This hand, you can even balance your body and put it there. Okay. Then after doing this one, this is where a coach will come and start to feed. Feed the ball. We are introducing the ball here after you have mastered everything here okay are we clear so are you ready for this all right let's go let's get on thank you all right.
That's it.